Madrasas, publicly funded Islamic schools offering classes in Arabic and teaching the Quran. But here in the eastern state of Assam, the governing Bharatiya Janata Party, or BJP, has decided to make 614 of them secular. Science, maths, arts, commerce, all the important modern subjects, or the subjects which are uh, being taught in the other uh, institutions, those will be taught. That is what it's, this, this, there's no relation with politics or both or election, etc. It is related to the proper education, irrespective of any caste community, create proper education to the students. The state government says the schools will not close and teachers will not lose their jobs. Being neutral, if you say that if we give Quran, only the Quran as the subject up to some institution, why questions are like that? Why not uh, Bhagavad Gita? Why not uh, courses on Bible are being taught in the other institutions? That is why, to make it uh, equal. But critics disagree with the decision. A senior Congress leader from Assam says the BJP is implementing policies that discriminate against Muslims and are against the Constitution of India. And he says it's being done to win political support ahead of state elections in April, an accusation the BJP denies. So they are trying to pit each other. They are trying to spread the hatred so that the non-Islamic bloc, the majority bloc, would view the Islamic bloc as an enemy, enemy of the common people. You know, that is the main agenda. I'm telling you in a very simple language. The principal at one madrasa in Assam is concerned students will be disadvantaged by the new curriculum. We stand to lose a lot. The children who study at the madrasa stand to lose a lot. They could lose the livelihoods and employment opportunities. The future seems to be dark. Muslims have been the target of increased discrimination across India in recent years. In 2019, nearly two million people were excluded from the state census, many of them Muslims. Later that year, a law was passed granting citizenship to religious minorities from neighboring countries, except Muslims. For those who practice Islam in Assam, the closure of madrasas feels like another blow. Leah Harding, Al Jazeera.